What's up everyone and welcome back to the channel our show books and theories. So today we are going to do what? Today we are diving deep into the world of personal finances. So now some of you might be thinking oh money talks boring talks but hear me out. इस वीडियो को आप छोड़ नहीं सकते दिस इज इंट योर ग्रैंड पास लेक्चर ऑन सेविंग पेरिस वी आर टॉकिंग अबाउट बिल्डिंग रियल लास्टिंग वेल्थ पैसा किसको बुरा लगता है भाई सो डू नॉट मिस दिस वीडियो टिल लास्ट बिकॉज वी विल बी गिविंग यू सम अमेजिंग टिप्स विच आई गैदर्ड फ्रॉम फोर्टी अमेजिंग बुक्स भाई मैं खुद फोर्टी का हो चुका हूँ एंड देन आई रियलाइज दैट वॉट मिस्टेक्स आई हैव डेट इन माई अर्ली ईयर्स ऑफ इन द फाइनेंशियल मैटर्स and so i read 40 different books mujhe bhi finance and management ki book padhna shayad itna pasand nahi hai but yes that's right i devote 40 whole books on money management investing and building wealth but you will ask me why because frankly i was tired of conflicting advices out there in my 40s i was still confused about the mistakes i did in financial matters and i never want my kids to do the same or or my viewers to do the same So what I did, I read forty different books. I saw many YouTube videos and listened to many financial experts. You see, one YouTube video will promise say get quick rich with some schemes, and another is talking about slow and steady growth. So they all were so confusing, and more I searched, more I confused. Although I was too late in searching all these things, so I took it upon myself to become a financial literate warrior. I'll say. वॉरियर बनना ऑल दो आई एम लेट जब मैंने फोर्टी बुक्स पढ़ी आई रेड दीज फोर्टी बुक्स देन आई रियलाइज दैट नाउ आई एम अ वॉरियर बट आई एम अ लेट वॉरियर आई एम एन ओल्ड वॉरियर आई शुड हैव बिकम वॉरियर इन माई ट्वेंटीज दैन दिस वुड हैव हेल्प मी अ लॉट टू गेन मोर वेल्थ एंड टू लेट माई वेल्थ अर्न फॉर माई सेल्फ एंड दैट द रीजन आई डिसाइडेड टू क्रिएट दिस वीडियो सो दैट माई व्यूअर्स माई केयर्स पीपल द यंग पीपल हु आर वॉचिंग मी can create that wealth or can let their wealth create for themselves that is more important so let's start this video with more enthusiasm and let's see what are those four points which can gain you more and more wealth so do not skip this video that is very very important video i'll tell you and guess what after reading a lot i understood that there's no magic bullet in in becoming a financial literate but there are some key principles that the most successful financial gurus agree on so sabka crux ek hi hai bhai 40 books padhi maine and there the crux is same today i'm going to share those four most important ones that will set you on the path of your financial freedom so are you ready and do not skip this video because if you skip this video you will definitely skip your financial freedom To be financial independent and get rich, you need to only change your habits. Mind it, only habits. You heard me right. It's your habit which can make you rich or poor. But what are those habits? So be with me as I start them one by one. So first habit is master your mindset. You heard me right. Master your mindset. It all starts in your head actually. धीरू भाई या मानी या फिर अदानी इन सब के भी माइंड में या इलॉन मस्क के भी माइंड में कोई थॉट तो आया होगा ना इट्स ऑल स्टार्टेड इन दर माइंड सेट आर माइंड सेट इज अ पावरफुल टूल दैट शेप्स अ लाइफ इन प्रोफाउंड वेज इट इन्फ्लुएंस आर थॉट्स बिहेवियर एंड अल्टीमेटली द रिजल्ट सो मास्टर इन द माइंड सेट देफर इज नॉट जस्ट अबाउट फीलिंग गुड इट्स अबाउट स्ट्रेटेजिकली क्राफ्टिंग अ मेंटल फ्रेमवर्क that empowers you to achieve your goal and live a fulfilling life that's right your financial mindset is crucial you got to believe that you can build wealth ditch the scarcity mentality and cultivate an abundance mindset that's more important you guys see see money is a tool to create opportunities and a fulfilling life not just ultimate goal ye nahi bhai ki bas paisa kama liya khatam paise se paisa bana that is important forget these uh, get rich quick schemes they, they are not the worth one as your mindset is for financial matters then you can make money here's why mastering your mindset is a key to unlock the financial freedom 
many people approach uh, money with a scarcity mentality believing there's never enough matlab kabhi kami matlab kabhi pura hota hi nahi hai this negativity creates a self fulfilling prophecy and said cultivate an abundance mindset apne mindset ko na khula hua rakho usko positivity lao usko believe that you can create wealth that opportunities exist and that you deserve financial success aur jab aapki soch badlegi na then this shift in your perspective now opens doors and empowers you to take action see financial setbacks are inevitable we all know that but don't see them as failures but take learnings from them take experiences from them and take those experiences forward analyze your mistakes and just your strategies and keep moving forward don't stop ya aap khatam ho gaya sab ho jab paisa khatam ho gaya no you need to find your opportunities remember successful investors rarely get it right every time ye to aapka big bull ne bhi kaha tha kyun it's about learning from mistakes and bouncing back stronger so every time you need to learn if for example the stock exchange you keep on learning every day that which stocks work which stocks don't work and you need to finance is something which you need to learn every day you need to identify and challenge any negative beliefs you hold about money maybe you believe rich people are greedy or wealth is unattainable so these limiting beliefs hold you back so you need not to hold such type of negative thoughts replace them with empowering affirmations like i'm worthy of abundance i'm capable of achieving financial freedom this is what is mastering your mindset it's crucial but it's just a first step combine your positive attitude with concrete actions like budgeting saving and smart investing all these things will help you remember building wealth is a marathon not a sprint so be patient stay disciplined and enjoy the journey towards financial freedom isliye kehta hu early start karo start thinking about your financial freedoms in your 20s second point prioritize your money money ko prioritize to karo pata ho chale paisa kahan hai knowledge is power but action is key take control of your finances learn to budget effectively track your income and expenses See there are amazing apps and budgeting methods out there. Aajkal to bahut kuch hai mobile. You will search and you will find Paytm app, hai, Grow and there are n number of apps. Just find out which one can works for you better and which one is handy for you. Remember every penny counts. Ek ek rupaye karke na ek bhikari bhi bahut ameer ho jata hai. So you need to understand that every penny counts. You can't manage what you don't understand. ये ये बहुत इंपॉर्टेंट लाइन है यू कांट मैनेज वॉट यू डोंट अंडरस्टैंड सो इफ यू डोंट अंडरस्टैंड फाइनेंसिस इफ यू डोंट अंडरस्टैंड स्टॉक इफ यू डोंट अंडरस्टैंड म्यूचुअल फंड यू विल नॉट बी एबल टू सक्सेस इन टू इट सो यू नीड टू अंडरस्टैंड दोज थिंग्स एंड दैट इज वेरी इंपॉर्टेंट वंस यू सी वे योर मनी गोज यू कैन मेक इनफॉर्म डिसीजंस अबाउट वे टू कट बैक वे टू इन्वेस्ट इन टू इट सो उसके साथ वही खादा होना चाहिए ना अनलेस यू नो दैट वेर इट्स कमिंग फ्रॉम वेर इट्स गोइंग यू कैनॉट plan those things so you need to plan it plan it properly prioritize it properly so prioritizing your money allows you to break free from this cycle ki paisa aaya gaya paisa aaya gaya but if you prioritize then you can actually plan it by putting a conscious effort into savings and budgetings you create a buffer against unexpected expenses kabhi koi bimar pad gaya kuch accident ho gaya it anything can happen we, we have not seen our future so you need to be prepared for all those things and that is where the prioritization and planning is important this financial security empowers you to make choices for the future not just react to the present but prioritize your future so prioritizing your money allows you to invest not just in stocks or mutual funds or bonds but also in yourself is pe hum aur bhi detail mein aayenge bhi is point this can take money from consider pursuing higher education or acquiring new skills that can increase your earning potentials learning a new language for potential career advancement or taking online courses on real estate ya koi coding ki language seekhni hai ya python seekhna hai all ways of leveraging your money for long term growth these things will help you in long term because wealth is a journey not just a destination and this point need to be remembered when you prioritize your money you shift your mindset from scarcity to abundance you view money as a 
tool to create opportunity and not just for fulfilling life, not just a mean to an end. This positive outlook keeps you motivated and focused on your long term financial goal. So, don't think about today, think about the far is important. That is important. The third point is invest in yourself and your future. This isn't just about saving money. It's about growing it. Invest in yourself. Invest in yourself. Learn new skills that can increase your earning potentials. This could be anything from like uh, taking online courses to pursue a higher degree. Remember, the most valuable asset you have is yourself. Just like we say, any product like sabun, soap, or surf excel or shampoo, or a software. Why we get keep on getting new versions of software? You all must be having mobile phones. And mobile phones, you, every night or every quarterly, you see a new software version of mobile. Why? Why company want to upgrade the softwares? Because if they'll not upgrade their softwares, people will not buy their mobile phones in future. This is applicable on you also, on me also, on human body as well. So we need to keep on upgrading ourselves. If we'll not upgrade ourselves, we'll be outdated. People will not want us to... We will, will not be usable. We will be useless. So it's very important for us that we need to keep on upgrading ourselves. We need to consider ourselves as a product. And then need to upgrade ourselves so that we are still a sellable product. Maybe you are in the 60s and 70s too. But you need to keep on upgrading yourself regularly. The more you develop your skills, the more valuable you become in the marketplace leading to a greater potential for income. Learning new skills or acquiring a new certification isn't just about money, it builds confidence. Our confidence is also when we learn something. That is important. But you know you have valuable abilities, you can negotiate salaries with more leverages, pursue more challenging opportunities and even start freelancing or side hustles with great belief in your success. We all know that today's job market is constantly evolving and it's becoming more and more different. It's becoming more and more skill-based jobs are coming. And in the future, it will be more like that. So by investing in yourself, you actually learn to adapt and embrace change. New skills can open doors to entirely new career paths or can make you more well around candidate within your current field. This ability ensures you to stay relevant and competitive in a constantly shifting job landscape, which is getting shift with every quarter. The knowledge and skills you gain today will pay dividends for years to come. Job retire okay, there could be a possibility that what you have learned in your early ages, you can start a business in your, uh, in your retirement. They become the foundation for further learning and growth. Investing in yourself is a continuous process, creating a snowball effect that propels you towards greater career. So keep on learning. Whatever you want to learn. It's not necessary that only coding language can be learned. It can be financial problems. It can be YouTubing. It can be singing. It can be dancing. Whatever you feel that can upgrade your skill, you should learn it. The last point is, patience is key. Sabra kafal meetha hota hai. Building wealth like takes time and effort. We all know that. It's not that one day job that key. Today, I'll do something and I'll get a lot and a lot of money. It never happens. It's hard. Maybe it's hard, but it never happens. So you need to keep on working, working, working so that you can accumulate wealth. You can let your wealth work for you. So don't get discouraged if you don't see results overnight. That's not possible for everyone unless you have some lottery like they Consistency and discipline are your best friends. So be patient, stay focused and keep learning. These are the best points to get financial freedom. Remember, this is just the beginning of your financial journey. So if you like this video, do give a like, do the subscribe button, press the bell icon and tell me in comment section what are the next topics you want me to cover or what's your feedback about this particular video. Did you like this video or do you feel that no, there's something missing or if you have any suggestions as well, do comment so that I can also get motivated and keep learning from you because that is what matters to me. So what we have learned in this video today, you need to upgrade yourself. You need to keep yourself upgraded like a software version so that you're always ready to 
find new opportunities and to gain more and more knowledge and earn more wealth out of it. You as a product are never outdated. That is most important. Second thing, be patient. Aram se socho. Money is not something that you can earn in a day. Money takes time to grow. Third point, let your money grow by itself. That is very important. You need to build an assets, not tax. You need to build assets so that your money can start growing by itself. That is another point which is very, very important. You need to understand where your money is coming from and where your money is going on. Unless you know the complete statistics of your money, you will not be able to control your money. So you need to, to control your money, you let your money grow, you need to actually understand the complete uh, incoming and outgoing of your money. For that, you can use any apps or you can use some spreadsheets, even your diary will work for it, but that is important. But the most important point is the positivity in your mindset. You should not think that, oh, I cannot make money. Not like that. You need to be positive and always think about how you can make money. And every day recall in the night, that's yes, I will make money. And my money will make money move for me. And keep upgrading yourself with new skills, new ideas, so that you can understand how you can make money. So unless your mindset is changed, you will not be able to make money. And these are the basic points which I, a basic crux I'll say, which, which I found out from these 40 different books which I read. So on, in one place before reading these books, I was too much confused about watching various videos, consulting to various people, and I was totally confused. But then I picked up these 40 different books, which are amazing books and best-selling books. And when I read them, these are the, this is the crux what I get from from some rich people, from some amazing people, and the crux from everyone is the same. So hope you like this video. Again, I'll say subscribe and comment. And do share with your friends if you feel that this is an important concept and they should know in the early ages. Till then, bye-bye and be with books and theories.